Hello everyone, I'm Polly and this is the sixth episode of trying to design an island in seven days using only crafted items and um, I actually terraformed uh, a little bit uh, off camera and um, I, I didn't do too much and I, I'm still not able to um, pay for that bridge and uh, to upgrade the house uh, but maybe I can do kind of both on this episode I still haven't figured out how I'm going to do that sad barn let me just show you what I did real quick so I elevated this uh, part behind the resident services um, it's like a big square now, I have to mold it a little bit more, um, but I guess I'll just place the plots first and then I'll mold it, you know. I also flatten this side a little bit more, I need to uh, push it further back to have more space for this lake next to the farmhouse and I'm not too sure what's going to happen here <laughs> today I guess we can work on the orchard maybe extend this a little bit more close off this part of the river because I don't think it makes a lot of sense here at least like here you know <laughs> um, but before we do anything else, uh, I think it's time to spin the wheels, right? First wheel, the wheel of fortune. What did what we're going to get? Three. Bay of one bridge incline. <gasps> That's honestly really awesome. <laughs> Um, and tomorrow we either get 100 new miles tickets or 10 items that I don't have a DIY for and honestly at this stage I don't know which one I prefer I I want a bunch of items that I don't have the DIY for but I also still have two villagers that I don't like and would like to get rid of so I don't know which one is better wish I could have both you know okay so misfortunes let's let's do this or what for have to customize all the tools okay I mean it's not as bad as designing a whole outfit right I guess I have that bridge taken care of. <laughs> um, where should I start? Maybe here, it's a little space and I think we can take care of it real quick. I don't know, I was thinking of doing the barbed wire fencing, but you know what, then it looks too similar, so maybe this one here. Do I keep this access to that part there, or do I close it off? Should I put like mini trees there, or like a smaller one here and a bigger one behind? Yes, I think that I'm going to do that. Let me get some saplings. I don't think I have saplings on my storage anymore. When I did the 15 day challenge, I actually thought of doing like a seven day challenge instead. Uh, that was my first uh, idea. But then I was like, maybe seven days is too little. Let me do um 15 days and then i did the 15 days and it 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 should have 
I, I should have learned that 15 days isn't a lot of time either. I should have learned that 15 days weren't like a lot of time either. So probably 7 days were... It's too short. Oh, too sh oh. Why can't... Why, why, why can't I plant there? Then I can plant there. I thought I had space for 2, 3... Like, come on. But you know, this time I was like, maybe, maybe I can do it. Maybe... Like, maybe I felt like 15 days weren't a lot of time last time because I was also really not prepared. And I kept forgetting stuff and messing stuff up. But now I, I have it fresher in my mind, like how I'm supposed to do stuff so it's going to go better this time but i forgot that i couldn't use my little tricks to um, accelerate the the whole process and it took me way too much time to get the three stars should I try to make an island in seven days, but like without any restrictions in terms of stuff that I can use on the island? Like I can't use Nintendo Online to get stuff, but I can use like whatever items I feel like using. Maybe that way I could do it, right? Uh, I want some flowers. Where are my flowers? I guess the island still looks cute in certain areas, but I don't know if I can work on every part of the island, honestly. I'm going to move uh, one of the houses to that, uh, to behind the, the resident services. This plot still haven't sold it yet. Um... But I also don't think I have Nook Miles to go villager hunting. Yeah, I only have 2,000. I don't think I can find anyone with one Nook Miles ticket. <laughs> but I also need to move that plot today. So hopefully, as I'm time traveling, the plot auto fills. If not, I don't know. I mean, I guess not all my islands need to be perfect. <laughs> I'll try my best to decorate the areas that I have now. And the rest, I can just close it off. And I mean, I know that's kind of... I don't know if I want to see cheating, but it's kind of like <laughs> lame. I don't know. Um... Leaving a bunch of areas not decorated and like closing it off and saying, Oh, that's, that's just scenery. That's what I wanted all along. But I may... It may be my only salvation for this island, honestly. Oh, I also extended the canal at the front of the resident services and connected to the river mouth back here um nothing too fancy just try to make it super natural vibes you know i need to move stuff around and if they're all ugly on that part of the island like it's just the egos neighborhood you know at least they're all together they're like Put in a corner of the island, they're all like sharing their ugliness. <laughs> I'm sorry if that sounds super mean, but what I'm trying to say is at least the cute villagers are like together and they're not like mixed in with the ugly villagers that I don't like. Still sounds bad. I. Uh... Like, not to be mean or anything, but they are ugly. <laughs> At least I'm honest about it, right? Wait. Let me... 
Let me clear my pockets and terraform this area so it's not too straight. It's it's looking weird. It's it's looking very weird. Okay, guys, some exciting news. <laughs> uh, while I was uh, preparing this area, um, I got this DIY from a balloon and I'm so happy because I really, really wanted it. Uh, I also want to make this for the farm. Uh, and uh, I don't think there's anything else exciting on this. Uh, uh, concerning DIYs but I was I act I also had like an idea for this house maybe give it a little bit of a yard here you know I need to get some edges and I was thinking uh, I don't know if I want to put the stairs to the uh, that cliff um, horizontal or vertical and I just realized that I don't even have the kit yet I need to place the plot down <laughs> that's what I was doing and I forgot um, maybe I could put it here right I don't really care um, and then I, I, I want to um, extend this uh, lake yes that's a lake right sorry sometimes I forget what things are called in English uh, but um, then there's a lot of space here to um, maybe have uh, I wanted to decorate it like um, that area uh, of uh, Nook's Granny and the Able Sisters you know have that kind of decor uh, up here so yeah maybe I'll put the other house right next to this one and another one more like on this side and then I can do some flower beds and have some trees and all that but um let's open our gates real quick and I'll pay off the bridge uh, to uh, the shops area so I can place the kit for the bridge okay here I am ready to pay this bridge wow they, uh, the villager hel villagers helped with like 800 <laughs> bells thank you so much guys and done thank you so much myself <laughs> there's so much stuff i need to work on oh my god hopefully i can get these two neighborhoods done today and tomorrow oh this is cute this is so cute this is such a cute item i should be focusing on <laughs> the neighborhoods but i also need nook miles tickets and money oh my god okay it's the next day it's a little bit more cloudy um we got six thousand nook miles from um completing some nook miles tasks uh, I need a um, DIY bench or something on this area even if I end up not being able to um, make like some sort of barn I could just do like a, a space for crafts and all that and, and like um, storing some uh, gardening kind of soft stuff um, so I'm going to put some of the brick path here, you know, real quick. Having path, like, changes the whole thing, you know. Suddenly, it looks like it has purpose. It doesn't look like it just 
came out of nowhere. You know, I just crafted some stuff to get some nook miles and also have some stuff in general. <laughs> Let's play some of these green leaves. Okay. Need to put a build... Oh, I, I also need a bridge here. I, I totally forgot about the bridge here. If I end up not having a lot of money, I'll just um, do like a land bridge. Okay, I'm going to get the bridge kit and the and taxes plot. The serious part now. Which uh, stairs should I get? I wish these stairs weren't as bright orange as they are. I'm going to choose the stone stairs as, uh, um, again. Even though I would prefer brick stairs, but like match with the floor. You know, I wish we could customize the stairs. After this one, we only have to move one plot, guys. I left two square. In, uh, initially, I was going to try and put the stairs right next to the resident services. Then I remembered that I can't. And uh, this way, I can plant like trees next to the resident services, between the resident services and the stairs. So... Yeah, I use my brain. Can can you believe that? I actually use my brain to do stuff and not like didn't do the first thing that came to mind and ruin everything later. Mm -hmm. Maybe I need to extend the, this um, first level a little bit more because I don't really have that many that much space for the other house. Like it's going to be right where the this um first level ends and i don't know if that's going to look cute but uh let's see if ali is crafting something okay i don't know if i should like uh get rid of this area um because i will be extending the um oh my god but it's what is it called um The lake. I'm going to be extending the lake uh, towards uh, here. So maybe I could have like the lake behind these houses and you can could come up here and look in the distance and like the this would end here, you know? I would get rid of this area Put a lake down there and then do some mountains in the distance and have like a little lookout area that you can probably only see if you like come up to here. Um, I think that's a plan. I'll start not this one. I'll start also um putting some pavement down on this area. I don't know, guys. I don't think I can replace these villagers. Let's leave it like that. <laughs> There's the idea. And once I know what to do there, I'll, 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 I'll work on it. Oh, yes, I was going to get these flowers out of here i'm going to get some edges i don't remember if i have edges on my storage and you know what would look cute here a little brick well i just have to buy the diy recipe so uh i can't really put them here because i think that's going to block off the access but i'm going to do it like this just a tiny little yard i'm going to see if that plot has been sold <gasps> it has been sold oh no i don't know if i want to look jitters who the hell is jitters 
It's the Brazilian bird. <laughs> I don't know if it's supposed to be a Brazilian bird, but he has the Brazilian colors, so I'm gonna call him Brazilian bird. Also, why can't I have that uh, hanging clothes thingy? That's like one of the first recipes that I ever get. I mean, not even in one island, but like normally I get that recipe right away. Where is it? I'm going to plant the peach orchard. I should have some path here, right? I also want either the vertical boards or the tall lattice to put it on the back, you know? Um, but first I need to craft some more edges. Okay, I um, have some bushes here. I was like, do I have some bushes? <laughs> um, and another one here. Um, I have a tree that I can plant. No, I don't. But I have <laughs> more edges. And I also made some barbed wire. Uh, what? For uh, the... Oh my god! For the orchard, I grabbed some bamboo. And I'm going to have like a little bamboo here. And I will also grab some sugarcane and plant it there. And I put some path here because like i said it everything looks better if it has path let's just add some sort of pathing on this area as well maybe i'll get some more bushes and put here and there okay and i guess i'm going to harvest all these crops uh, i got these blue roses uh, because I think they look nice with the pansies, you know? They're kind of bluish in the middle, bluish, uh, purplish. Um, and then I'll plant another one here when I have it. Um, but for now, I'm going to tra time travel so I can move the last plot and, and also get jitters on the island. There's so much that needs to be done and tomorrow is the last episode. Why did I think this was a good idea? Let's move the last plot. I'm going to pay uh, some of the bridge. I just want it to look woodsy, you know? Did I grab any bushes? Do I have any? No, I don't. I do not have any bushes. Um, I'll also get that tree that's in right in front of the stairs. I have that swinging bench that I don't know where to use. So maybe I could use it here. Okay, I got some bushes. Let's plant them real quick. Oh, I forgot the swinging bench. I knew I was forgetting something. I'm back and I have the swing. <laughs> um, okay, let's plant some flowers. I didn't want to plant it there, but whatever. You know what? I don't care anymore. Okay, for now, I'm going to leave this area like this. I'm going to plant a sapling here. Is this like weird? You know what? I'm going to plant a tree here so it doesn't look as weird. Let's plant some flowers here as well. Guess I can plant some trees here. Well guys, turns out I'm a dumbass because I have the the large lattice fence. But like I probably have had it for like some time because I don't remember buying it. <laughs> I'm going to put some of this fencing 
here behind the house. I don't know if I put it behind or like uh, next to it, you know? Because the, supposedly <laughs> the house is going to look bigger than that. So, okay. Let's put some of these fans here. Whoops, not on the tree. Oh, you know what would look cute here? What would look cute here? <laughs> um, the wild bench. The wild log bench. I believe I have hardwood enough for that. And I'm going to plant some uh, trees up here as well. Okay. Can I get a tree up there? I think I can. Okay. Um, I'm going to time travel. So we can move Jitter's house and hopefully Leaf will be here tomorrow. We have a villager at the campsite. Um, so I guess let's check it. What, what did he give us? I don't like him. Bunny day bed? I don't remember which DIY that is. Uh, I need to get these flowers out of here. Uh, because they won't duplicate. They don't have enough space. So, But uh, let's see if we got lucky and got a <laughs> cute villager on the campsite. Uh, I'm laughing as I say this because I don't believe. No. Okay. Let's move Jitter's house. And uh, no leaf, but yeah, I need to have a little bit more space up here. Okay, I think this is enough for me to put his house here. Hello, Timmy and Tommy. I want to sell a bunch of tomatoes and potatoes as well. This time we have way more produce than last time. Um, so I think we can pay off the stairs. Great. So I'm going to sell the last few produce that I have. And then I'll time travel. Uh, and put the bridge kit. And I don't think we need any other bridges and inclines. We have 10,000 nook miles, which is great. If we decorate most of the things today, I think we could like replace at least like one villager. How do I get out of here? I'm stuck here. Okay. Um, you know, maybe, maybe, just maybe. Could y'all talk somewhere else? Oh, I can still plant the flowers with them talking there. Uh, I need a bridge. Should I get a bridge? Um, this like simple, a super simple one? Or should I? Uh, I'm going to get this one, you know. I don't even care anymore. Why is he thinking? If you're thinking you want to live, no, you're not. I want to put a bench here and maybe another one here. Oh, just something simple but cute. Okay, let's craft and customize the benches real quick. See how pretty that is. Super cute. I haven't decided what fence I want here. I was thinking of the um, barbed wire fence, but like that re requires a lot of um, iron nuggets and I don't have a lot of them. So then I thought of the that picket, picket fence, you know, the white one. Uh, but then I don't know if I have enough 
right now because I've used it in other places. So I don't know what to do. I honestly don't know what to do. I mean, I really like this area. I think it looks super pretty. I don't know if it's cottage core, but it's pretty, you know? I guess I've given up on the cottage core dreams and I'm just accepting that this island probably doesn't um, live up to the cottage core designation. <laughs> and now I'm just going to plant these saplings and let them grow. I don't care. <laughs> Maybe I could have this country fence. Hold up. Yes, that's exactly what I'm going to put there. <laughs> why think about it? And why not just do it? Things are flowing way easier today. I don't know why. Maybe I'm more inspired today? See, I was thinking of putting this country fence here. Finish this uh, pavement as well. Okay, guys, uh, I've done some terraforming back there. Um, I'll decorate it tomorrow, probably. Uh, I'll keep it super simple. Ba maybe put some flowers and shrubs and, that, and all that. Um, but, you know, um, I will also close this off. Um, 